Welcome to Southeast Ohio Solar Haven once again. Oh boy, you see a midnight sitting there, don't you, today? Well, before we get to this, I'm going to show my power production today since we like to live off grid around here. We got 6.5 kilowatt coming in there, and that's going strong. And then the second controller, it's just keeping up with 3.4 kilowatt hour. And it's not because there's not the same amount of power. It's just these are in follow me mode, and this is the main one. So this is this one will take over before this one will. Good power production today. As you can see, batteries in absorb. Um, it actually says it's 100%, and that's only because if you come over and look at here. My power production is only 21 amps into the battery, so yeah, that's because I'm off grid, I'm using it anyway. Well, we got the uh, another charge controller in. I went out and found one on eBay for the wind, and this is the 250 volt version that you see out there on eBay that's really cheap right now because uh, a bunch of them were auctioned off or whatever and there really isn't much difference between the new model and this one um, other than there is some features that you do not have with this um, I done pulled this off it's still got the display uh, but it doesn't have the, uh, it doesn't feature the, uh, speaker on it. So, you don't have voice or whatever, but that's, you know, who wants voice, really? And I done unscrewed this lid off here so we can see inside. And you'll notice one thing right off the bat. We do not have these two extra ports. And... Those were used for the follow me mode and to link all the different midnights here like mine. I've got my cords where I can link them together for follow me. This one doesn't. It supposedly the auxiliary uh, the auxiliary jacks and all that's supposed to not even been on here, but they're on there. So it makes me wonder if they actually still do work. Which is a possibility. I haven't hooked it up yet. Still got your Ethernet port and your battery sense port, and then you still got your jack to plug into your screen on the front of it. So, otherwise, it's a 250 volt controller. It's great for high voltage input. Um, yeah, depending on how, you know, you could use it for panels also. Um, you're not going to put very many panels on it because of the 250 volt input because it's 62, 63 amps max. So you get like, oh, if I, my memory serves me right, you can get probably seven, 750 watts worth of panels at 12 volt, 1500 watts max at 24 and uh, probably around 2800 at 48 volt but for high voltage applications and for the price you can't beat them you can pick them up on ebay <clears throat> i've seen a lot of places anywhere between 279 to about 319 you might pay shipping some places you get free shipping with them but for the price you can't beat it now, if you can't live without the follow me mode, you can get a hold of Midnight and you can get this top control board replaced. Um, I believe you have to give them your serial number for the uh, Midnight charge controller, but you can get this board replaced with these two jacks that you need. And it would probably, I believe... I'm not sure if that feature would be enabled, but it probably is. Probably has something to do with this control board itself. But uh, for the price, it's unbeatable. And I'm going to be using that for my wind turbine 
and possibly I will jack a couple solar panels on the side that way if I need to just do all solar because there's no wind and I need the extra charging I can use a franken switch over here I've got like a switch air I got I got loads of these things I could use to uh, switch over I'm gonna have to make some rearrangements here though because I want to put this midnight here I want to put it like right here and this I might bring it down to a lower position because I plan on removing this and possibly moving this down on the wall here so because this is my main inverter pretty much this is the only one I really use right now it's it's the four kilowatt inverter has proven itself to be a load taker power maker run everything that I need and it has it faltered me once um, I the, uh, the I haven't used them and since I've got this this thing has ran all my loads and it's been on 24 7 now for oh six months so uh, like I said, these Ames inverters, they prove themselves. Um, maybe later on in the future, I'd like to get a uh, 6,000 uh, watt version of it that's uh, 24 volt because the switch over to 48 is going to be a bear. And uh, it can run my central air just by itself and then I can have a four kilowatt running my 120 volt loads I'm it works great my power consumption around here is low today I'm you can see what my power consumption is right there 680 80ish watts I mean that's not bad and that's running my computers and whatever in the household yeah so, we're going to go with this midnight, and yes, they are new packaged. I mean, you're getting, you're getting that, you're getting a new battery temp sense. But I can tell you where they come from. If you all remember the Ponzi scheme, I believe it was out in California. I, if I'm wrong, correct me, but a big, corp, a big company guy or whatever, by the name of Karpov got put away in prison for some money Ponzi scheme well you look right on the side of the box there check it out Karpov look the name up yep <laughs> dirty sucker <laughs> but anyway that's what's new on the agenda for that and they're brand new uh, they're a bargain of a buy. Um, those control boards, as I was talking about, you know, they can get expensive. I've seen them for two or three hundred dollars. That's if you really are desperate for that follow me mode and all that other stuff. This will hook up to the internet. You can do your control on PC and with it and everything, so it works out just great. You know, for me, it's a separate controller for wind. I don't care, and that's the way it's going to be used, unless for emergency situation. To where I need to use all my solar because, like I say, this is a hybrid system still. Some of it split off to a grid time inverters and split off here to the battery. But we're still going strong. Uh, this is about 3 o'clock in the evening. I'm doing this. So, I mean, you can see solar power is great. Battery voltage, absorb mode good in charge well have a good sunny day take care and stay warm later on guys